What's up guys? I'm back and today we have actor and film producer Nikimutuma and he has been forced to issue another statement in response to sexual assault allegations that happened way back in 2017. Now, these allegations have resurfaced again just a few days after his film Sincerely Daisy premiered on Netflix, okay? And now few women out there wants the film to be pulled down because of these claims that Nick had assaulted several women sexually, okay? So someone here said, so Netflix, Netflix film, do y'all know an actor from Sincerely Days has been accused by multiple women of sexual assault? Now that's when the lady involved in this situation decided to respond and she actually defended Nick and said the issue was resolved back in 2017 and people have no right to bring it up again. She said, this is something I thought had put behind me. This has been a very private and personal issue for my family and that I feel I must now speak upon. In 2016, there was an incident between Nikki Mutume and Nan that my partner Kome Gitobu posted on social media in November 2017. Nikki Mutuma reached out to us shortly after and we resolved it amicably and privately in 2017. I want to be very clear. I will never allow the voices of any victims to be silenced. I believe in accountability and I believe that any person that perpetrates any form of violence or assault must be held accountable. However, this is not such an incident. I thought I had put this behind me and moved on until the issue recently resurfaced on social media. I personally have no ill will against Nicky Mutuma. I admire the progress he has made in his career and I wish him all the best in his future endeavors. Like I said, this issue was resolved and I hate to see people using it to tear Nicky down. So that's what she said concerning this harassment situation. Now, as I said, Nick has been forced to respond and he issued a statement and said, The last few days have been a nightmare for me and my family. Here is the truth. The allegations that came out against me in 2017 that have since resurfaced have really taken a toll on me. They have really affected my family and suddenly they have and continue to affect the people in my personal and professional life. I know I'm not perfect but I'm not the person that people try to portray me as. Every day I work towards being a better person but it's so hard to do that when you are constantly being pulled back by people that are convinced that you are a monster. This has been a very difficult time for me and my family not just because of things being said about us on social media but because it has been very difficult to talk about this i did not want my silence to be misinterpreted as guilty or compliance yet i also do not want to speak and have my words twisted and misrepresented it is so unfortunate that despite this have been put on trial in court of public opinion, prosecuted and ruled guilty by persons with malicious intentions, hide the fact that this has gotten in the way of something that I have built for a decade, yet despite all of this, I have still kept my head down and worked towards my goals. And that's it guys for this video. Thanks for tuning in. What do you think about this situation? Leave a comment below. Subscribe to the channel for more entertainment news and updates.